Hi and welcome back to the channel. I'm going to do something I've never done before in a video and that is an unboxing of a camera. Uh, and it's a camera that you've probably never heard of before. I certainly haven't. Uh, so this is just going to be the unboxing and a brief look at the camera. In another video a bit later on, I'll be doing a full review, review of it and putting a roll of film through it. So, let's unbox it. Okay, so let's have a look to see what's in there. I bought this camera, one, because I'd never heard of this type of camera before, and it looked really good, and in very good condition. So, let's remove all of this gubbins. Very nicely packed. Put the box to one side and It's actually a camera that was made in Germany and I've heard of lots of different types of, oh look at that, a bit of a teaser there. I've never heard of this one as I've said earlier and it sounds like a cross between a German camera and an Italian camera. So, get rid of this and this is it. It's called, zoom in a bit, it's called a Vredebosch Flitzia and it was manufactured in 1954 and it's a, it takes 120 film and gives 6x6 six six images. So I'll zoom in a little bit more. There we are. Now this is the first time I've seen it and in the pictures uh, it looks in really good condition and I must say it is. It's got a couple of little scratches at the bottom there but other than that it's really good. Nick uh, for a camera made in the 1950s, mid 1950s and it says on the bottom there made in West Germany. So what do you think? Have you heard of this camera before? Let me know and if you've used it and I'll be doing a full review of this after I've had a little bit of a play with it and I'll be doing a review, as I said, and showing you some images taken with this camera uh, probably within the next couple of weeks. So, short video there. Please like and subscribe. There'll be lots more cameras coming to the channel. Uh, cameras that uh, are famous, uh, like the Canons and the Nikons, and cameras that uh, are quite rare and you don't see many reviews on YouTube of them. So again, thanks for watching and see you very soon.